Hello, and welcome back to Species Spotlight. This week, we are going to learn about a striking bird that makes unique nests, the Baltimore Oriole. Baltimore Orioles are a medium-sized bird that can be seen in the summer in eastern and central North America. As migratory birds, Baltimore Orioles overwinter in Florida, the Caribbean, and even Central America. They prefer habitats such as open woodlands, forest edges, orchards, and stands of trees along rivers, parks, and backyards. Baltimore Orioles are slightly smaller than an American Robin and have long, thick-based, pointed bills. Adult males are flame orange and black with a solid black head and one white bar on their black wings. Females and immature males are a yellow-orange on the breast, grayish on the head and back, and have two bold white wing bars. Young male Baltimore Orioles do not molt into their bright orange adult plumage until the fall of their second year. Baltimore Orioles were named after the male's plumage, which are the same colors as the heraldic crest of England's Baltimore family. Orioles are more often heard than seen as they feed high in the treetops, searching for insects, flowers, and fruit in the foliage and on small branches. Sometimes you can find them in shrubs and lower branches, plucking fruit from vines and bushes, or sipping from hummingbird feeders. In the summer, they mainly feed on insects and even go after pests such as tent caterpillars, gypsy moth caterpillars, and fall webworms. Other insects of interest include spiders, beetles, wasps, and snails. When feeding on berries, Baltimore Orioles seem to prefer only ripe, dark-colored fruit. As Baltimore Orioles are ready to breed, the female will find a spot to make a nest. Their unique nests are shaped like a pouch that are firmly attached to a fork in tree branches. The females are the main builders and weavers of the nest, while the males stand by and sing to defend the territory. Females use plant fibers, strips of bark, grapevines, grass, yarn, string, and moss to weave the nest together and are then lined with fine grass, plant down, and hairs. Building the nest takes about a week, but windy or rainy weather may push this to be as long as 15 days. While many other birds defend large feeding territories, male orioles defend only the space near the nests, so you can usually see several neighboring orioles feeding close together. The next time you are out in the parks such as Amico, Boundary Creek, or Smithville, Take a look if you can find them high in the treetops near water or listen in for their unique calls. Thanks for tuning in to this week's Species Spotlight.